In today's video, we will be becoming Jin Wu and exploring the world of solo leveling all in Minecraft Bedrock Edition. We will see mobs from the anime and also this pretty cool scene remade into the game. Stick around and see what happens next. What's going on my legion? Welcome back to another Minecraft add-on showcase review. Now this is a bit of a different showcase review. This will be made into like a little mini series slash add-on. Now just looking at this right now, everything just looks so cool from the texture pack to like how everything is set up but anyways you might be wondering why am i on top of a pillar well because when you spawn in you have no spawn protection at all so people like this girl under me will constantly attack you and same thing for that thug over there if that thug would have saw me he would have came over here and probably murdered me but anyways getting started go ahead and click the first thing in your slot and it says choose your rice you have human and that's all we really have click okay and then choose your character, which is only Jin Woo. And then down here, we do have shops, but I can't really access them without uh, this girl right below me. So before we go ahead and go down to the shops, I will tell you guys about the thing on the top right. Our race is human, our HP is 40, our TP, which is training points, we have zero of those because we haven't killed any mobs yet. We are rank E, we are the lowest rank, we are level zero, and we need 5,000 XP just to rank up once. Now your current XP level, like the Minecraft XP level, is dependent on which rank you are. Right now I have zero levels, I am rank E. And I think every like 50 or 20 levels or so, you will go ahead and rank up. All right, so I went in creative mode and down here we have buy weapons. Now we use money pouches to buy weapons, wooden sword, shield, metal sword, metal shield, all this other cool stuff in here. Then we have skills, you can go ahead and buy some skills. We have dash, stealth, healing, a punch chain, super punch, monarch's domain fire arrow and those all sound pretty cool too and look at that each one is tailored with its own like little area this one's like magic and boxes and chest this one's like weapons swords and shields this one's all food items where you can buy food items with coins and dungeon drops you go ahead and sell your dungeon drops for coins and then you sell your coins for uh money pouches now over here we have info now this info tells you oh you need to be in survival mode to play this game then over here we have dungeons. This tells you where the first two dungeons are. Now dungeon number one is at 683, 63, negative 11. And that's pretty far from where I am right now. So let's go ahead and run to this village over here. Okay, we have made it to the village. All right, all right. Let's see if there's any blacksmiths here because we do desperately need a blacksmith. Wait a minute. I just noticed something. The curator uses the seat that I use for my showcase videos look hold on that's where we spawn this is the village area this is the water and then like this is where i showcase the stuff at down here oh my god okay i was getting chased down but since this is the exact seat that i use i know where the blacksmiths are at there's two blacksmiths in this village right here yep with iron oh yeah we're, we're cooking bro we're good the armor looks so big on us oh my god all right so let's go ahead Cook the iron sword. Where's he at? Oh, 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 two of them. Oh, yeah, they hurt. They kind of hurt. Oh my god. Yo, they hurt. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Die. Got one. Oh my god. Okay, as you can see, we got 60 TP, 240 XP, and yeah, that's pretty much it. That's all we got. So I'm pretty sure for every 150 TP, you can go ahead and level up one stat. And over here, we can go ahead and click on dungeons. And this also tells us where the nearest dungeon is. So right there, it tells us. And then this right here, it teleports you back to spawn. This is your profile. Uh, It tells you your, your attributes, your status. I have four health, two strength, and one and everything else. Anyways, on to the next blacksmith area. Hopefully, we do not get jumped. Okay, I see an enemy right here. But we should be good. I'll go ahead and make a quick turn. There we go. Is he coming at us? Oh, it's a girl. Oh, she kicked me. Okay. Different animations for different characters. Pretty cool. Good jump. Oh, get out of here. Whew, what's in here? Obsidian. More iron. Boots. I think we have boots already, yeah? Yeah, we have boots. Okay. Oh, my. <gasps> dude. Dude. The villagers jump scared the crap out of me. Why would you do that? I need wood, bro. Wood is the most essential thing I need right now. Hold on, guys. The dungeon is coming soon. Just hold on. Because that dungeon... It's super duper hard. All right, now that we have some wood, let's go ahead and make a shield. And let's make a, what, some sticks? Make a new iron sword. Make a, ooh, a pickaxe and a, make a pickaxe and an axe, I think. 
Yep, an axe. Oh, <laughs> the shield! Why is it like that? Why does it bounce me away? <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> All right, so I went and created for trying out the custom shields. They all break when you put them in your off hand. <laughs> so I literally have to switch between defending and attacking. Defending and attacking. And each time I defend, I jump back for some reason. <laughs> or forward, whichever way I'm looking. All right, guys, so I just went ahead and grabbed the shield from creative. Let's see if the same thing doesn't happen. Oh my god, the same thing happens. But I don't bounce around. Okay, pretty cool, pretty cool. So I'm gonna go ahead and keep this shield, but like just keep it in my like my main slot hand. Okay, I kind of feel like we're kinda ready for the first dungeon. Even though the first dungeon is rank D. I I think we're ready. So let's start making our way over there right now. Also, these buildings right here carry nothing in them. I wasted my time. And just there's nothing in those buildings at all. All right, so we made it across the um the island over there, not the island, but you know the place over there. We got pretty far. We're almost there. The coordinates for the uh, the dungeon is like six six hundred ninety three or eighty three, something like that. We'll know once we come across a city and once we come across a uh the six hundred coordinate. Okay, we are coming up on a village right now, so hopefully this village will have something good in store for us, like some like an iron chest plate. Our helmet because these mobs deal a lot of damage to the player and it's insane okay we're right here let's hope that they have a blacksmith please blacksmith oh wait i think i see one wait no i don't no no blacksmith i'm not seeing a single no you serious dude at least any hay okay we have hay of course they have hay i also been killing um these uh criminals at 540 tp so let's go ahead and put some stats in. Oh! Oh my god! Oh, you see what I mean? Oh my god! Dude! I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. No. No, I, I, can't. I came so far. I came so far. Dude! Oh my god, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. In the house. Okay, I can put something right here. And just cheese him, alright? You guys wanna come in? Hello? Oh my god, peekaboo. Oh my god, dude, they scared the life out of me. Okay, guys, so I killed one of them. Next one. Oh my god, get away. Go. I got this. I got this. Get out. Oh my god. Too scary, man. Too scary. Okay, we're at 600 now. And I think the next coordinate is 11. Negative 11. We're, 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 we are way far off. So 683. Then 11. Oh, it should be over here. First dungeon. So let's go ahead and start putting in stats. Because once you enter a dungeon, you can no longer put in stats into your uh, your skill points. Okay, if you watch solo leveling, the first dungeon boss, we all know what it is. It's that big, creepy guy. <laughs> or the, the god statue, whatever. Now, in this add-on, you have to survive for two minutes straight against that statue in order for the cool cutscene to happen. Oh my god, get away from me. There we go. I'm stronger. Like I said before, these chests aren't, aren't even worth, like, looking through, but I'm gonna look for it. I'm gonna look in them because I'm an idiot. Um, am I ready? Am I really mentally prepared? Maybe? Let's see. I'm crouching. I'm crouching. Okay. Oh, rank D dungeon. Recommended only for rank D dungeon rank D. You guys think I'm ready for this? Nah, I'll be ready. We got this. We're Jin Wu, but uh, we are level 1 Jin Wu. He was kind of a bitch. All right, guys. I have healed back up to full HP. Let's go ahead and get this dungeon started. Is that a red? Oh, you're fast. I'm dead. I'm dead. 10 damage a hit? I'm, yeah, I'm dead. Oh, back up. Stay away. Stay away. I'm dead. GG's. Oh, my God. The damage they dished out to me in those few moments. All right, guys, it's time for a trading montage. Okay, we are back and we leveled up about three times. Yeah, there we go, three times. 
and we have 3330 TP which may sound like a lot, it probably is, but this should be enough, right? This should be enough to get past that dungeon. Put in some health, a lot in strength, health, strength, magic, of course, oh, look at that. Let's go ahead and view our profile. 16 health, 16 strength, and nothing in the magic speed or jump. We have 160 HP. So I'll meet you guys back at the dungeon once I'm there. Okay, so when you die, this dungeon stays active. So once I get in there, I gotta start blocking for my life. Am I blocking? Yeah, there you go. I'm blocking, I'm blocking, I'm blocking. Oh my! I don't know what to do. Sword. I'm taking, I'm taking 10 damage a hit, it's insane! Oh my god. Shield comes in crazy. And then go ahead and right click on the dead mobs to pick up the drops. All right, now time for us to clear out the rest of this dungeon. Cleared up the first wave, pretty cool. No, we didn't, we have a goblin left. Get out my face, get out my face, get out my face. Bro, these taps of like, of how hard and fast I'm clicking my mouse. The last one, last one, last one. Get out my face, get out my face. You hurt a lot. Yo, these dire wolves, man. Summon next wave. Oh my god, get away from me. Ow, 10 damage still hurts a lot. Oh my god, the wolf came straight at me. Oh my god. Alright. Ooh, 230 TP per kill? That's actually, yo, that's a lot. Alright. Is that a glow squid? Are we underwater? Oh my god, the dungeon's underwater. Of course, of course, of course. All right, so we have to summon the next wave right here. Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm my guard down. Oh, wait. Oh my god. Oh, yo, those wolves, like I said before, they are fast. Oh, there's two of them. Oh. Oh, they're fast. I'm dead. I'm dead. Please back up. I'm dead. Dang it. Dang it. No, we were so close. We have to go back in there. Also, each time you die in a dungeon, you have to go ahead and put yourself back in survival. Because once you enter the dungeon, it puts you in adventure mode. All right, guys, we are back at the dungeon. 210 HP. We are doing some mad damage with our sword. Here, oh my god, they ran straight up on me. Get out of here. Please move. Get away. There we go. There we go. These drops will come in clutch. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh my god. Alright, let's see what else is in here. And I think this is the last wave we have to start. Yep, there it is. Oh, we piecing them up. Oh my god, we're piecing them up. Oh! Got here, got here. And I did give myself a spyglass. Just to use it as, like, I guess, Optifine. Oh my god, he's running to Yo! I didn't even see him running towards me like that. Bro, it was a crash out menace, bro. Then last guy. Easy. Too easy. There we go. There we go. Whew. Oh my god, do I think I'm ready? Do I think I'm ready? My armor is looking pretty busted up. Come on, episode one. Oh, there he is. There he is. Look at him sleep. Oh, look at him. Look at him sleep, guys. Oh, just like the anime. Oh my god. Okay. Let's watch him arise. Hey, buddy. Oh my god. That scared me. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. So, in this boss fight, we have to survive two minutes. The surviving two minutes is kind of insane. Just look at his face. Oh, where's he go? Okay, this, this face, bro. The model looks amazing, though. All right, well, you guys came in for content. And you guys will get content. So let's go ahead and win up on him real quick. Oh, oh, his name is Deuce Deus. Oh my God, bro's actually fast. So right now I'm out of his reach. Are you going to put the laser eye? Oh, oh, okay. Ow, ow, he popped the laser eyes. I think I'm dead. I, I think I'm dead. I don't think I'm surviving in two minutes. 
Ow, ow. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Dude, he's insane. So for the sake of the video, I'm gonna go ahead and cut to where I do get the animation. So my game glitched out, so here's a better perspective on what it's supposed to look like. All right, so it says solo leveling. You have completed all requirements required for the secret quest, the courage of the weak. You have required the right to become one player. You accept? Accept. Ooh. Hello? What happened? Is he gone? Oh my God. It's like nothing happened. Oh my God. There we go. Daily quest. Preparing to get stronger. Incomplete. Punch a hundred times, shift a hundred times, jump a hundred times, run a hundred times. Attention, failure to complete this quest uh, daily rate will result in a punishment associated with this question. Oh yeah, look, I'm good to go, okay. But I do think that is a good time to wrap up the first episode. If you guys did like to enjoy this episode, hit the like button, hit that sub button. Like I said before, it's like an add-on showcase review plus mini-series. And once you do beat the other dungeon and of course the centipedes, I will go ahead and showcase everything else that I missed. But anyways, remember Chris Legion, why United, and see you guys in the next one. Laters.